welcome back to my channel it's your girl az may williams how are you all doing hope you guys are good hope you guys are fine if you're new to this channel kindly click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video last night was a movie guys this housemates kept me up all night with their drama yes guys now there was a prank <laughs> that was sponsored by big brother yes i mean they had a tax that is um liquid rose and saga like i told you guys earlier on or yesterday yes and the tax is specifically like pick a fight with your uh, with your partner the your love interest and you know avoid them basically and liquid rose started the tax pretty early yes and saga also surprise surprise you know started his own tax it was a roller coaster of emotions and oh you think that's just a drama mm -mm. cross and angel also had their own drama last night it was a fun filled night yes guys so let's start with liqua rose and emmanuel I mean, I think that's the only one that actually gets into my feelings. <laughs> because really, if, um, Emmanuel, do, he, he doesn't know what he did wrong. The guy is apologizing for the things he doesn't even know he did. At some point, I actually fell for him. Nick Rose, ha, that girl is an actress. At some point, she was like, oh, you're trying to flip it on me now, Emmanuel. Oh, you don't even talk. What about, and why is it that I'm not the only one that's trying to resolve issues? Emmanuel was like, what happened to the girl that said, I love you, the quiet you and everything? She was like, oh, you're trying to flip it on me right now? You're trying to flip? I'm like, ah, and no quite my agenda. <laughs> but it's all for a good cause, Sha. They'll be fine. When, you know, the tax is over, they will be fine. You know, Saga and Nini, Nini could not believe it. That, I mean, that Saga would ever eat with her heart. You know, uh, when she had, she kind of confronted Saga about it. You know, she was like, you always do this on me. You always do this. You always do this. Even when I was put up earlier the uh, day before, I don't do this. You always do this, blah, blah, blah. And she stood up and like, if you are going to continue like this, don't ever effing for, um, don't ever effing talk to me again. And she stood up and left. In her mind, she was thinking, oh, Saga's going to come. For we yeah, Saga was there. Saga move it not. He was there, yeah, planted the play like a, a tree planted by the riverside. <laughs> At the end of the day, Sha, they all slept in different places. Saga remembered his bed in the blue room and when they addressed it and he slept there. I think that would be like one of the most uncomfortable nights of Saga's life in the Big Brother Niger house. Same with Nini. I mean, I think that's why she woke up and she went off and crossed like that. Yes, basically, um, I think Liquorius actually cried. I think theirs is emotional because, I mean, they love each other. But I think this um, space is actually good for Saga. That's what I think. And he's doing great. Kudos to Saga. Well done, Saga. I'm proud of you. I'm really, really proud of you. This space will actually do him a whole lot of good. Yes, guys. Now, um, while that was going on, we did not know we had investigators in the house. Detective Perry and Detective Cross. They said they're going to be finding out what is going on in the house. That's something fishy going on. Something fishy going on in Big Brother's house. Like, how? Huh? What is going on? Cross is mad. <laughs> he was like, I mean, Saga cannot stay. Like, Nini has never stayed on her own for 30 minutes without Saga being there or 30 seconds without Saga being there. Saga has never eaten on his own. But we are see they are seeing all these things yesterday and he was like no something is actually going on they also talked about liqua rose and emmanuel like what is actually going on that that's the one ship that the only thing they were, they were waiting for was for it to land you know they were actually confused but they said they would get to the bottom of this matter you know they actually went to speak with um liqua rose but the girl managed to turn their head turn it on their own and all that and also they spoke about yusuf they said yusuf is loving like he's a very smart guy but he's loving every girl every time of the week or every week and basically um that that's why they feel this is parrot talking that's why he feels that you know angel will use him to catch better crews and oh talking about angel and cross they had their conversation where angel was like see you're my best friend so we should not 
be doing, you know, all this touchy, touchy thing. Don't be touching me. Don't be kissing me like that. And Cross was like, what do you mean? Why can't I touch you? He was really sounding as if, I don't know, to be very honest, that conversation, I don't know if it's Angel that has fallen for Cross. We all know that Angel has have always liked Cross from week two, but she's managed to keep it to herself because she feels like Cross likes other people. Or is it that Cross is falling for Angel or he just wants to catch better crews with her? I do not know. But he was genuinely concerned, guys. He was genuinely concerned yes guys and that was what happened you know at the end of the day um angel was like we can't be kissing we can't be doing all that you know across was like is it i mean i thought this best friend thing will lead up to something and she was like there's no way i mean you still like sasuke you know go and do that with every other girl in the house and he was like there's no other girl blah 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 that why can't he touch her blah 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 at the end of the day, Sha, the conclusion of the matter is that they are just going to be best friends. But let's see how that goes. Friday, Saturday party. Let's see how that works out for them. They Sha sealed it with a kiss. Yes, guys, they sealed it with a kiss. And at the end of the day, um, Angel slept on his bed last night because... I mean, he actually told her for the last time that they should kiss and for the last time she should come to his bed. So let's see if that's truly the last time. The person I pity most in this whole scenario has got to be Yusef because after that, you know, Yusef was cuddling up with Angel in the game room and she actually related, you know, the whole cross situation to him. And Yusef was like, okay, cross is the best friend. Me, I'm the, I forgot what he called himself, you know, and, um, Angel also made it known to Cross that even though a lot of people feel like they, she and Cross are an item that they are not, that she doesn't like um, Yusef romantically at all. <sighs> I don't know, guys. I don't know what is going on in Big Brother's house, but this is actually interesting to watch. Last night was a movie. Meanwhile, in the garden, Cross actually called Sasuke Obim. And for those of you who are not evil, it means my heart. So, I mean... I think Cross is still hung up on Sasuke, but the only thing that is stopping him from making a move on her is basically because Jay Paul is his friend and he does not want to break the bro code, whatever that is. So yeah, but I still think Cross likes Sasuke. He likes Angel too. He even told Angel that he likes her romantically, but me, I don't know if he's, he's just catching crews. I feel he likes her too. They're going to be great friends. You know, they are going to be great friends. Something might happen between them, but I don't think it will happen in the show. It might be outside the house, but let's see how this plays out. It's interesting to watch. I want to see if Saga will actually continue with this whole um, tax. I mean, knowing what happened between Nini and um, Cross this morning, I want to see if um, Lee Quarrows can actually keep up with the whole she and Emmanuel thing because I think he's taking a toll on her. You know, this is the price we've got to pay for love. How much can you actually sell your love, basically? But last, last, I think they will all be fine. I think they will all be fine. It has made Big Brother's House a bit more interesting. Last night was very, 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 very interesting, to say the least. Which was your best part? Liqua Rose and Emmanuel, um, Saga and Nini, or Cross and Angel, or Angel and Yusuf. For me, I think the one that actually got me my feelings has got to be Emmanuel and Rose. I think those two people actually do like each other against our better judgment. I think they actually do like each other. For Saga and Nini, I feel this is good for Saga. I mean, let Nini know that you can't always have this man's attention and be denying him in public. Yeah. Vote for Saga. <laughs> but seriously, guys, seriously, I'm, I'm in a good mood because I want Saga to be on his own for a while. I want Nini to understand that Saga is not your play toy, that you just wants around you to give you attention and you deny him in public i don't like that i think that's one of the reasons why i keep harboring on the fact that i don't like it when saga follows nini all around it's making him look as if he's always available which is not and this will teach her that he is actually not available like that yes guys i wish they would just um invite the other females in the house into this tax you know <laughs> i don't know like to make them jealous we already know that nini is kind of like jealous whenever she sees saga and sasuke imagine when sasuke comes in not as safe like to act along play along you know it's gonna be super interesting nini will just go off ah <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it you mean? I'm not mean, no. I'm not mean. I just want drama. Yes, guys, that's about it. Thank you guys so very much for being part of my channel. I'm in a good mood this morning. I woke up very 
happy <laughs> thank you guys so very much for being part of my channel if you've not already subscribed kindly click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video till i come your way again i remain your darling girl Neil williams have yourself a beautiful day ahead bye guys